hello welcome to my channel once again once again you see this is freetown sierra leone i am on a motorbike um, and i'm giving you how this place looks like freetown sierra leone this is some parts I think they said, they said the western side, some parts of the western side in Freetown, Sierra Leone. See, um, when it comes to Freetown, it's it's a lot like if if you have to say something about Freetown, it's actually a lot, I must say, and. Looking at how the place is, bro, I don't know whether I can live here because all I say is the people that live here, they are very, very brave. They are very, very brave because I've heard stories of what usually happens here. It is not pleasant it is not pleasant at all see island people get on alive on this hills bro anybody watching this video if you know free town you know how mountainous the place is Bro, the hills are a lot just look at this place there is no proper guard this is like um i think this fence wall will, will do justice to or will help a bit but some of the places that i saw there were there was no guard like real to support the edges of the road and just look at the way these motorbike riders they ride on this side of the town it's hill hill so bro i don't know if anybody knows free town watching this video there are some parts they have the rails guarding it but there are certain places too they don't have the rails and that is my problem that is my problem because beside maybe on your left or your right when you look down you have houses all over down 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 below and you are on a hill just look at this place just look at this place no guard no no real supporting the edge of the road or whatever and then anything can happen imagine someone um, being on their motorbike or maybe in a car and, and brake fails along this side you see this is the only worry I have and I've actually been hearing there is there is actually a university at the top here and I learned every year some of the students they get on alive because because of these mountains and even some buildings collapse from the hills and people get on alive man people who live here they are very 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 brave trust me this was my first time climbing this hill and being in Sierra Leone climbing this hill and I'm telling you I don't know how I was feeling like how I was feeling within because Charlie and the motorbike riders for them they are used to the road so they don't really um, try to be careful like that they, like they don't really try to be careful when they are moving around this area or plying the road Charlie it's just crazy I just love um, the place to be honest yes but these are some of the few problems that I have this I think the university starts from a place like this also see these are some of their buildings 
these are some of their buildings please anyone who knows the name of the, of the university if you're from Sierra Leone you can drop it in the comment section but trust me this is one of the see just look at all the side no god no nothing bro it's just crazy it's just crazy man you know um i was saying this that if you are from Sierra Leone and if you're from Sierra Leone and perhaps you want to I think there is one thing that I've heard I learned they are trying to construct a bridge connecting Lunge and Freetown I have been looking at the, the situation and everything I have said this that if you, you are a Sierra Leonean I think you should try and buy land in Lunge because the, the day that that bridge will be constructed the day that bridge will be constructed I'm telling you a lot of people in Freetown will move to Lunge will just buy land there and build there and that's is, and Lunge is where the airport is so imagine if you are I don't know maybe you've not thought of this but if you have thought of this or you've not thought of this then me I am telling you I am from Ghana I am in Sierra Leone now and this is what I have I have observed trust me Freetown is the capital it is congested and the hills I know that a lot of people don't really like to stay around these areas because of the the nature of the landscape or the landscape of the of, of, of the place so trust me if you really want to invest or do whatever I think buy land in Lunge right now because if this bridge the day any government or any yeah any government comes to power or even this current government decides to construct this bridge I am telling you it is going to open up the country and secondly a lot of people because Lunge is like the closest town to Freetown Lunge is like the closest town to Freetown so trust me if they are able to do this a lot of people will move to Lunge and Lunge they have a very flat land Lunge they have flat land like everywhere is flat Lunge everywhere is flat so why won't I um, live in a place like that than to come and live here bro people get on alive they say it all the time when the rains come people's buildings collapse and people get on alive so why would I stay in a place like this you see why will I stay in a place like this a lot of people would love to live in a very cool and uh, a place that has a low risk of you harming yourself or um, something happening to you so for me this is what I, I have observed this is just a video to show you some part of Freetown and I'm actually in, 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 in Sierra Leone now so I'll be dropping some videos couple of videos about free uh, about Sierra Leone and all that so keep watching yes keep watching and keep watching yes I'll be dropping more videos I love the country though to be honest with you I love the country yeah but these are some other things that I have noticed and I feel like um, these few things if they do it it will really really help a lot yes so enjoy enjoy the video and yes enjoy enjoy